President Donald Trump is insisting that GOP leaders in Congress give top priority to securing truly effective control of U.S. borders, as the 115th Congress resumes its work. In a recent tweet he said candidate Trump won the 2016 election in large part because of his call for a border wall, and his willingness frankly to portray the damage unbridled illegal immigration inflicts on the individuals and communities that comprise America's body politic. GOP leaders in Congress have perennially refused to speak forthrightly for the overwhelming majority of their party's constituents as candidate Trump did during his campaign, much less act with determination to address their well-justified concerns. Instead they acted with barely concealed contempt for what they contempt as racist, parochial passions, in the name of what they claim to be the higher road of bipartisan statesmanship, generosity and compassion. Now the Ryan McConnell wing of the Republican Party appears to be running scared at the prospect that addressing the border and immigration issues early on, as part of an overall agreement on spending for fiscal 2018, as the Democrats would like to do, might lead to a game of chicken focused on the prospect of a government shutdown. Despite much evidence that, outside the purview of elitist faction disinformation, a solid majority of Americans want immigration brought under control, the GOP's elitist faction leaders embrace the open borders, 